So I'm going to show you exactly how to screen record on your Samsung Galaxy A15. Now, unfortunately, there's no native way of screen recording, which is very weird. I don't know why Samsung does this on these types of phones. But to do this, we will have to go make our way over to our Play Store and download a screen recording application. So make your way over to your Google Play Store, and you want to go and type in screen recording. There are tons and tons of different screen recording applications you can download. So in this case, we'll just go and download the first one that we see here, which is Screen Recorder X Recorder. So go ahead and go through and download this particular application. Now you can download any one. It doesn't only have to be this one, but download the one that you actually find that you actually like and prefer yourself. And you'll basically be able to find the application in this way. So it's going to take a little bit of time to download. Now when it downloads, all you're going to want to do is just basically wait until it actually officially downloads here. Once it's downloaded, all you want to do is click on the open button right here, and it's going to go and open up into the X recorder application. So now once it goes through it, it'll take a few more seconds for it to actually officially go through. You can see you want to enable the recording stuff. So you want to click on here and you want to enable exactly what it's asking you to enable. So it's going to take a few seconds. You want to appear on top for this one, and then you want to go and go back. Now when you click on back, you want to click allow basically to everything it needs. You don't have to allow notifications, but you can if you want to in this case, I'll just allow. Now when you're ready to record, you want to click on this record button. And then again, when you get these pop-ups, you want to just allow and you know just use whatever you can. And you want to click start now. So now it's going to count down from three. And then it's going to allow you to just jump and start recording. So now you can see that this XR recorder thing is on top. And so whatever I'm going to do, it's going to start recording. So now if I want to, if I want to just jump back out, you can just click on here. I can pause the recording, stop the recording. I can edit or take a photo, whatever. If I want to go and stop the recording, I can click on the stop button right there and the recording will now be stopped. So now what I can do is I can just go ahead and, you know, I can watch the video again. You can see the screen recordings right here. I can share this recording out. I can edit this recording. So I can basically just do whatever I want to at this point. But what you probably want to do is you probably want to save it. So at the very top, click save and you want to save this particular application or save this, you know, whatever this video out to your you know gallery. So once it's saved, you're pretty much good to go. And that's basically how it's done. It's a super basic process. So if you have any other thoughts or questions, click on over here. Let me know in the comment section below. Hit the like button. Help me so much, but definitely hit that subscribe button. More importantly than everything else, I love every single one of you guys. Hopefully I'll catch you guys in the next video.